This video has been sponsored by Hostinger, the most fastest and reliable and the most affordable web hosting platform on the internet. Hey everybody, welcome back to another design tutorial in Adobe XD. And today we'll be uh, creating some hover effects uh, using Adobe XD and using Figma. Now Adobe XD by default doesn't support um, hover animations or hover trigger right now. It's in development and I'm hoping it'll arrive soon. But till then we have to take out some method of actually uh, creating some good quality hover animations to showcase to uh, developers or other designers or just to, uh, you know, brag about how you can create some crazy good hover animation. So without further ado, let's just get started with this video. Now, I've already created this basic card interface. As you can see, this has uh, various layers inside the group and, uh, you know, of text and the button as well. And it looks minimal. It looks very simple. Uh, but how do I now create, uh, you know, a hover animation. So I'll go to my browser, which I'm using Firefox. Before we go on to actually creating the hover animations, I would just like to switch tabs really quick and show you our today's sponsor. So hostinger.in or hostinger.com is the fastest uh, web hosting platform and also the most affordable. As you can see, they have extremely affordable prices uh, and and a lot of added features and benefits. And if you quickly go to hostinger.in slash Puneet Chavla, uh, which is today's unique code, um, go to hostinger.in slash Puneet Chavla and click on get started and go down and select any of these hosting plans. So I'll quickly go ahead and add this to cart. And by, while, the, uh, while this loads, I just wanna tell you how Hostinger uh, helped improve my web design career when I started off into design. I was more of a web designer than a UI designer and this really helped me out because they, this was very reasonable to purchase as well as this was the best. This has a lot of extra features that you don't get with a lot of other reasonably priced hosting platform. Things like e uh, added email support, uh, a lot of domain support and you can even buy a or buy or get a domain name through Hostinger as well through the store right here and uh, the store provides so many extra features things like G, G Suite, cloud hosting, Cloudflare protection which is very important these days, daily backup and so much more. And all this at a very reasonable cost. And if you add promo code section, just say beneath Chavla and add this promo code and you will get an automatic 15% off your entire hosting order. Since I've ordered single web hosting, I have gotten 324 rupees off, which is a great and just 1,836 rupees for 48 months. That means three years of continuous dedicated 24 by seven life support, secure payments. And you can even try this service for 30 days without, you know, making a total payment. And obviously they provide lifetime SSL certificate, which is included free, which by the way, costs extra money. If you go ahead and buy a hosting anywhere else, this is very reliable, very uh, reasonable priced and I've used it many a times for my web development or design needs so go ahead and use this uh, for your needs as well today okay so that was today's sponsor anyway if we go ahead to figma.com and just quickly go ahead and sign up to figma this is a website you don't need to install an extra software for this that's the cool part and if I go ahead and add a project from here I'll say new file and uh, this should immediately open a new file for us where we will do our hover animations okay so all we need to do now is go back to XD, uh, just select this group, say Command C or Control C to copy it. And I want to go to uh, Firefox really quick in Figma and I'll say Command V or Control V 
to paste this right here and as you can see our asset or our group has been saved here <laughs> now i want to quickly scale this up in figma if you go here and say scale you can easily quickly scale this just like this without losing on its attributes and um, now that i've saved this here i want to quickly uh, duplicate this by saying command d or control d and in the second artboard i want to change some of its properties so uh, here i want what i want to do is you know maybe change the fill of this card in the background so i'll maybe give it a slight gray to showcase that it's being hovered over or i can maybe even give it like a light blue or something like that and you know just something random i just want to show you guys how this works and maybe even lift it up a little bit just like this perfect now what I want to do is I want to prototype this. How do you prototype it? Easy question. Go to the right hand side, top right hand side here, go to prototype and say, if I click on this right here and I go to prototype on the top right hand corner here and I say while hovering and action, I'll say um, Surface Pro 4.1. This is what we want and uh, rather than saying instant i want it to uh, push just like this in any direction to be honest and um, preserve scroll position and ease in out 300 milliseconds is fine and on top right i say present and if i click it'll open a new tab don't worry about that and uh, if i hover over this see how this quickly pushes it see how this quickly dissolves into something else if i hover over this again see how this is presented and you can change all these properties you can say uh, another artboard or you can see say ease in out as well and rather than saying push you can even say dissolve and that is how intuitive it is and that is how quickly you can create hover animations basic hover animations with figma i hope you guys like today's video i post every monday and thursday so don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also click on that bell icon so that you get notified about all my videos first and also click a like click the like button if you like this video and i'll see you in the next video God bless.